Hey guys, it's B-Dog here and I am ready for this because we've been doing this a lot of times actually we've been gotta be wait we've been waiting for a couple months for this but here's here's to this one. I'll be right back in a moment. I'm back dog again. I really hate it when I took the stupid dogs out, man. Stupid dogs in again. So let's get on with this video real quick before I go to town and stuff. But I am aware to this. This is gonna be good. So it's gonna be a good thing or a very bad thing. So we gotta react to glitch newest upload murder drone season one trailer. So let's get to it. Three, two, one, and let's get to it. Go. Late 2022. That is right, Murder Girl Season 1 is officially greenlit and we have everybody who checked out the pilot to thank you. Also, all of you who've got a M plushie really, really helped. And we have a special surprise for you guys. Hello. Hello, Kevin. And we, Ken, <laughs> has a special friend now, <laughs> the V plushie. Hey, V, how's it hanging? Shut it, N. <laughs> you got it. Check out the V plush now <coughs> over on motordrums.store for the next 10 days. You can get help for 15% off. Every single plushie helps towards the funding of the show to make it sit up and down. But get V quick because she's limited stock only. And lastly, guys, we've got a special surprise. Liam Vickers, a showrunner here at Glitch, the person who helped us write and direct Murder Drones, will be joining us together for a little Q&A. A bunch of you guys asked us some stupid questions, but also low face questions that we are going to be dishing out today. Well, let's go meet the man himself and answer those questions. I guess that makes Hello. sense. Oh, how's it going? Oh, how's how's yeah. murder droning? Oh boy, it's it's happening. We're do, it's doing <laughs> it's the happening. thing. Uh oh. What do you think of the fan reception to the pilot that it's been? And what do you think people think about N? Yeah, it's been amazing. I, I think we've been having so much stupid fun on our end. So to see even a little bit of that transfer over into a enjoyable <laughs> viewing experience is like, hey. It's the best, you know? Can't ask for better than that. Let's begin with the fan questions, Kevin. Yeah, Liam, so question number one. So if Uzi's dad can take off his mustache, can Uzi take off her hair? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, she probably can. Cause, cause the drone hair is obviously not their own hair. They've, uh, borrowed it. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, perfect. Why did you choose Glitch Productions as the animation team? Ooh. Ooh. We kind of made it together at least you know it was we kind of came up with the idea for murder drones specifically because of what you guys are and like what you had done in the past with like that kind of really kind of spiffy cg stuff so it was like oh let's do cg and you guys you know had done video gamey kind of stuff so it's like ah well robots you know or video <coughs> hold up a moment it all kind of ties into that sci-fi thing Stupid so dumb uh, yeah i think it was less thing of a thing of like oh who can make this project and more like Let's make a perfect project for Sorry. These, these lovely fellas. Pretty wholesome. Yeah, I think you were mentioning this before, but it was like, because we had we had a very specific kind of show in mind. It wasn't necessarily like, oh, we want a sci-fi with robots, but it was more so, what's a good way to oh, well. make characters that look different, but we can also make them really efficiently. It was like, so how do you guys feel about murder? Lots of murder. <laughs> like, can we make them robots? And he's like, <laughs> Sold, and that's actually a big part of why we did robots. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, what didn't exist, it's... Liam wouldn't exist. I'm gonna ask a law question, Liam. What's up with the final scene in the pilot? When Uzi stands on top of uh, the car, she has a little moment. Because oh. we're coming for them. <laughs> wow, nice clip. All right, so. Uzi's, Uzi's having a little bit of a little bit of a hot mess moment here. Uh, she's pretty stoked to uh, go all robot on those people. A little spooky stuff going on with the eyeballs. What? Uh oh, what's going on there? That stuff. Oh, that's right. Liam, I noticed when you're like trying to deflect, you're just like, uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> I need to deflect. Better check this out. Better check that out. Whoa. Something's going on there. What's
What's over here? What is it? Is it tonal it's inflection? <laughs> I can imagine like nice. when you're younger, you have to come home and like his parents are like, why were you out, Liam? And you're like, uh-oh. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Especially the, like when it's capped off with N and his love gun. And he's like, don't read into this, my mind's in a weird place. <laughs> Anything with N is my favorite part of the pilot. I was gonna say, I do like that, that absolutely <coughs> silly amount of <laughs> corpses <laughs> spiraling into the air is pretty, pretty yeah. nuts. Who designed that? Black job designed that. What kooky crazy person. Yeah, I, did, I like how it turned out like just the right amount of barely visible. Yeah. You would almost certainly not assume it's made up of corpses but it's like it's something that you could infer if you look closely enough and i think that's the best kind yes. of spoof which is super fun so i think i think we hit that that balance pretty well or mm. and by we i mean oh, yeah. the awesome 3d artists jeez why door why, why door? not door why door yeah doors came from a like you know this this society is hiding and only one person thinks they should go on the offensive so it's just kind of taking that trope and just dialing it up super far and making it super specific, where instead of just like a general defensive ideology they all have, it's just one guy who's obsessed with doors uh, over his own daughter. Do you think we'll ever get door merch? If we could, yeah, if we could sell full-size, <coughs> like, oak wood doors, doors to people. Con, like, con, con made. Yeah. Made from, made from con. How does it feel to move on to work on a 3D show? That is a good question because it's it's great. It's really nice to have other people <laughs> working on the project for one, but especially you know people that have such different skill sets than me is really nice because then it, it really just shows how uh, how much better a product can be when <coughs> you know people work huh. together. You know you're each working off each other, and that's super evident because yeah. I can't do 3D at all, <laughs> so I'm 100% relying on people. It's really cool to see the talent in the glitch team taking our bullshit and then turning that into a like an actual product yeah a good looking product and yeah. at that <laughs> yeah no yeah. shout out to the glitch team for sure yeah yeah uh, cool I'm, I'm curious and let, let's tie this back to the content of murder mm -hmm. right what are some things that we can expect from the season robots robots are with pants <laughs> <laughs> everyone gets pants just kidding that'll never happen i'll die before they get pain <laughs> i will say probably whatever you're expecting uh it's not, that <coughs> it's not gonna happen and it's gonna be <laughs> something <laughs> way better and, and weirder and in a good way yeah and spookier. <laughs> it's it's gonna get way crazy uh and you're gonna you're gonna have to you're gonna have to sit through it <laughs> imagine yeah, okay. no. taking the hardest left turn <laughs> that you could possibly take <laughs> and then you turn left again <laughs> and your pants fall off i think that's a great way to end it i think um yeah Liam, do you want to say anything to fans hey thanks for thanks for watching oh my gosh having yeah we're, i mean we're having so much fun making it you know it's just so so great and wholesome to see you know people people digging it because boy howdy we're, we're making ourselves chuckle over here uh, so yeah, we're, we're really trying to push I guess this show on all fronts like what you saw in the pilot is just the beginning of it Both the visuals the storytelling the characters. <coughs> this is all new territory. For yeah, us. We're, we're trying to push it as like, <sighs> far as we can yeah. um, We're still obviously gonna have that general energy that the pilot had. Oh, definitely. Yeah, we're really excited The season we're looking at late late this year like really late. So don't expect it Yeah, we can't say what is it, when, anyway, when it's gonna come out. Yeah, because we don't want to give a date yet because Development is usually like this. Please go and check out the V plus if you haven't yet. Like I said, 10 days, it'll be 15% off. You can check that out at murderdrones.store. Give N a friend. See you guys next time. Look forward to Murder Drone, season one. Goodbye, thanks for watching. I'm sprinting towards you at full speed and I can't be stopped. Why do you have to do this? But that's the end for this one and everything is done. Jeez. Um, yeah. Uh, I guess that's it for this till tomorrow, I guess, I think. We'll see about it, but I don't think I'm gonna, I'm think I'm gonna be postponing everything, so. So that was Murder Drones Season 1 trailer, and it's not gonna become until later this year, and 
probably in November or it's probably gotta be October, November or December of this year. I don't know, but that's it for this one and we're done for this one. So let's get on with the outro stand, shall we? Check out Glitch for more videos in the future. Go check them out for more stuff like metal like more of stuff to do with uh, Moto Drones or Meta Wano or whatever. So that means follow me on Instagram, follow me on Twitter, follow me on TikTok, find me on Nintendo Switch, we on Snapchat, go on Animal Crossing, New Horizons, go on my dream. My dream address is down below in the description. Animal Crossing DLC is already out three months ago, so check out my Discord server down below in the description. And that is it. So then I'll see you guys in the next video. So peace. Bye. Mario might be a superman, but I'm gonna have a big tan. He might have went to the past and but I'm gonna make a new game have a new thing. Man, the Mario can't play. Okay. <laughs> By God, science said it couldn't be done. To avoid staining the bed sheets, all he needed to do was put a towel on it. Holy sh! That's genius. Why didn't I think of that? Yeah. Okay, I guess that makes sense, actually. <laughs> <laughs>